Okay, so this is what I'm going to be working on the next um, the next few videos. Uh, obviously, I've been working on the quarter panel and all the other panels and things, cell and cell, and cell extension, as you've probably seen on the previous uh, previous ones. However, um, the idea is to get all of this one side pretty much done. Uh, the front wing um, as well, a bit of the bumper and that sort of thing, a bit of the bonnet, various sort of things. But we'll get most of this done uh, by the end of February was the original plan. Uh, but it might end up being a couple of weeks into March because of lack of time. Um, either way, I want to get all this in white and primer, uh, including the rear bumper, all that area. Uh, I want to get all the boot in white primer too. Obviously it's covered in filler dust at the moment, but there you go. And some of the spoiler done as well at the same time. But this video is all about the door. Um, so the general gist is... Of course, it's going to be a gold wing, of course, it's already kind of attached, but it doesn't shut. This piece just flaps about because nothing's attached underneath. And as you can see it, probably can just about. Everything just flaps about underneath, isn't it? Nothing's attached or anything. Um, so the general gist is, it doesn't shut because I've made the sections inside here, which I definitely can't show, uh, but in this sort of area, uh, too wide, basically. So I'm thinking if I chop some of this out to make it so it's gonna sit properly at least for now and then I can put the bottom on this door which will attach onto in some, I can't really see it very well inside there basically I'll do it with a finger sort of along there uh, so it's going to be sit flush with the sill area on there that's the plan and obviously when you look down the car it's going to look normal so yeah, I'll uh, I'll do some work on this. I'll do a video at the end of what I've been doing today, so you can have a look and see how far I've got. Uh, and then there'll be another one probably start of next week, or the thought probably Tuesday or something like that. And uh, yeah, see how it goes. Okay, so part two um, done quite well to be fair. I've only had what two and a half hours on this. Um, so basically, the door itself now has had a lot of work cut out in the inside, which I'll put in the pictures. Um, probably the best plan um, and then basically we've got the door shuts uh, which need trimming back a little bit because it's not quite right the panel gaps slightly too far over to the door side so I've got a sand back here just to make it allow enough room for the door to go through when it's put together uh, but you can see obviously that would normally sit in there and inside the, the hole but obviously it can't at the moment but it will and it will shut as well, which is good news. Uh, this is where to gauge it from, basically this piece here. And it's not fully there yet, but it's not far off. It's only a couple of mil out. So I'm pretty happy with that. I'll be uh, working on that one, get it get it right on the uh, inside first. Um, but yeah, that's looking good now. So I'm basically the next jobs uh, for the start of next week is going to be to um, make sure this door fully fits. Um, trim these side bits like I was on about and then do a bit of work probably some fiberglass work on the mirror housing and put the mirror in it probably at the same time uh, and also put the bottom on the door like I'm showing part one uh, to get this basically trimmed up ready for uh, being solid again and not flapping about so yeah it's going on quite nicely so I'll keep the updates coming um, and well anybody who's not seeing any updates and thinking what the hell is that that's the window obviously um there will be a cover over this people have asked this before there will be a cover basically a lot like a normal window so there'll be all this section here will be obviously as it is uh but it'll be flattened back um fiberglass again on top of this filler and then obviously got straight in there um and then basically there's going to be a panel of glass uh, not glass, sorry, perspex to replace the glass uh, in the normal position. So basically be exactly the same. So I've, got, I've left all the, well, there's a few bits need trimming, but I've left all the, the gutter and everything else for the window to go in. So it's perfectly fine. It'll slot, slot near enough straight in there, to be fair. It won't be removable. It'll stay in there the whole time. The original rubber will go back on. Um, I think, I think it will anyway. If not, I'll make a different one, whichever. Um, same as these side ones. Uh, and then basically the uh, that perspex will then be over there with a either a, either a, a hole cut out there or to to basically 
you can you can sort of adjust the how much air comes through so obviously i might play the system the audio system with um with either the doors open most of the time i'm not sure yet uh it depends how it sounds but either with the doors open or one door open or whatever it may be for demos um or it might just be that we leave the door shut and then just have this like, section open on both sides or whatever it may be so yeah that's uh that's where i'm heading with it and um we shall see what happens next but feel free to comment subscribe if you can it does help and uh, obviously we'll certainly uh we'll certainly crack on with this and get this door finished so i can get the whole side in primer in it and make it look nice ready for video in a few weeks time